So, in this case, we have our CMS logo, which is our PLC. We have our programming PC, which we are going to program the CMS logo. We have the outputs as our bars, and we have the input sen uh, sensors as switches. Probably, as you are already aware, we have three examination and certificate accreditation bodies for Tibet institutions in Kenya. That is Kenya National Examination Council, NEC, National Industrial Training Authority, or NITA, and Tibet CDAC. That is Tibet Curriculum Development Assessment and Accreditation Council. For NEC, they are the examining body for basic education, that is primary school and secondary schools. And they also and they are also the major examination and certificate accreditation body for Tibet institutions. At National Industrial Training Council, that is NITA, mostly offers proficiency exams and short courses. And Tibet CDAC is a newcomer in this area, and mostly they are offering short courses for in Tibet institutions and level six courses in the universities. Actually, today in this lab, I have two groups of students. The one in overall, they are doing Tibet curriculum courses or Tibet Vatsida courses. And the one in Skybrew Dust Coats, they are doing NEC courses, which is a three year diploma NEC course. For the Tibet SIDA group, they are doing a six month short course, which is called Instrumentation and Control Level 4. Level 4 is equivalent to ATSAN. Level 5 is equivalent to Certificate or Craft courses. And Level 6 is equivalent to Tibroa courses. The main aim of this video was to explain about TVET CDAC courses. And as I had mentioned, the students in this video they are pursuing a level 4 course that is instrumentation and control. Take subjects such as uh, electrical principles, electrical installation practice. Uh, that's what they are doing in this lab. And they also take uh, a control course that is standalone controllers. And they learn how to work with pyrosis. There's quite a number of TVET institutions in Kenya, so I may not be aware of all the Tibet CDAS courses they are offering, you can always check from the institution nearest to you. Uh, the problem now comes to programming. How do you program this according to what we have been asked? As per the question, a supermarket has a capacity of 15 maximum shoppers. There are two doors, one on the entry and one for the exit. So this is the so this is the entry door where we have our sensor as our input, and this is the exit door. So in our entry door, when the number of shoppers in the store is less than 15, when the number of people in the store is less than 15, the entry door has a green light on which it remains on. In a remain on. Yeah. When the number of shoppers in the store is 15, the red light starts to flash 1.5 seconds on and 0.5 seconds off. This is all done through programming. You can't do it manually. You can only program it into the PC. Then you load it through the Ethernet cable to the Siemens logo. So the Siemens logo will do the part of sensing, will do the part of transferring the outputs and interpreting the inputs. In Meru National Polytechnic, we have Tibet CDA courses in agriculture mechanical engineering and electrical engineering. For mechanical engineering, there is lead operations, uh, manual metal aquarelling, both of them refer four courses. And in electrical engineering, there is instrumentation and control, again a refer four course. So for the courses in mechanical and electrical engineering, they are fully funded by GIZ, 
uh, that is the school fees and accommodation is fully funded so this is an opportunity that you might want to take advantage of you should keep on checking whether in various institutions there are pivot CDA courses that are fully funded uh, GIZ has been uh, funding these courses so that you can get this course for free if you are either you are coming direct from form 4 or either you are finished your ATSAN NEC course diploma NEC course or certificate NEC course is a very good short course for you I should also mention that out of the six months you'll be pursuing a level four course three months will be in school training and three months will be out for a mandatory industrial attachment so if you want to learn more about the Tibet CDA courses the level four the level five the level six uh, you can always ask a question in my youtube channel comment mostly i prefer youtube comments because that's why i check for your questions regularly not facebook messenger or facebook comments i prefer you do youtube also remember to subscribe to the channel for more information on various courses uh, soon i'll do a video on uh, nita how you can benefit through various proficiency exams especially if you are out there you have practice course and no certificate at all uh, nita will be very useful to you For this one, it's lighting, light of micro This one is also correct. You see, this is also correct. There are also more videos coming in general agriculture, agriculture engineering, food and beverage, IT. You can also check a previous Tivata CDA course that I made in my video description about mechanical engineering. And also watch my other videos in civil engineering, mechanical engineering, and electro engineering so that you can pursue a course of your choice. So check for the other videos about various courses in my video description or in the link shown above the video. Inform your brother, your sister, your cousin or relative or any friend you have about the videos that I make so that they can select courses based out of uh, factual information from a person who is doing the actual training and not based on what they hear from their friends and they end up selecting courses that do not match their skills, their interests and their talents. I've also made videos on how you can get funding from Coops and Herb. Check the videos on my video description so that you can benefit from these opportunities for free education in Kenya. For your lighting circle, for your lighting circle, you can just see here, after that point is completed. What about here? Probably the city is closed. Switch on. Switch on.
But alarm. I don't know whether it's because of the starter. Some of the starters are not are functioning. <laughs> Okay. This is the first sensor. This is the In a sense, at least 15 people in the, in the room. So, come out of the 15, this bulb remains on. I love you. This one goes on for 20 seconds. So, it's going to be on for 20 seconds. I love you. So, the next person gets in. This one will remain on. I love you. You for 20 seconds. And then, if you pick out to 15, I get that was the last person. If you pick out to 15, then I want to 15. No, no, I pick out to 15. E in Azima, but since E in a sense, in a sense, in a sense, in a sense, for a sense, the room is equal to 15. E in Azima, E in a under for green for 0 0.5 seconds now. Alafu ina juu na mdras pa sana bado ilikuisha isha moja mengine na dimeno kwa tena sisi kwa sababu kwa sababu sote na baki na hicho kwa hii juu rumi kufuata. But then if another shop comes in the shop, he in a sense, it's a sense, he in a sense kwa tena sisi. 